Today, we got some amazing news regarding one of the most anticipated hunting games, which is called Way of the Hunter. Essentially, we got the release date, a new trailer on the Steam page, and now we can pre-purchase the game. First of all, I'ma play the new trailer, the new video that was released to promote the pre-purchase. Still watching the rain, kids driving me insane. Another Groundhog Day routine. Month two, month four, can't take it anymore. I got to get my feet out the door. So put me on the train, I don't care where it's going. Fly me on a plane, baby, out to Wyoming. Need an RV, no plans, just you and me. I need to go somewhere. I need to go somewhere. As you could see, the game is looking really, really nice. We could see multiple shots of a jeep, which I would expect to be the main vehicle. I mean, we should be able to drive it. And I gotta say, the textures look amazing, the lighting is great, and overall the game is looking really good. But well, the important thing today is that we can already pre-purchase the game on Steam. And there are some advantages if you decide to buy it early. So currently, we can either pre-purchase the standard version or the Elite Edition. And if you decide to buy the Elite Edition, you get a 10% discount. And ignore the prices here because the prices vary depending on the region, but I guess in the US the base game will cost like $25 and the Elite Edition will cost a bit more than $30. I mean, you'll have to check because as I said, the prices vary. And well, apart from the discount for the Elite Edition, if you pre-purchase any of these two editions, you get a shotgun with engravings, a paint job for the car, for the Jeep, which is essentially an skin, and also a big, wooden carved, mufflon statue for the lodge. On this image we can see the engravings on the shotgun, looks like a fox chasing some pheasants, which is in a small detail, but looks nice, and then here we can see this really cool camouflage for the jeep, I really like it, as well as the mufflon statue, which I think should look nice. And those are the three items you get if you pre-order any of these two editions. Not a bad offer. We also have to consider that the Elite Edition is gonna include a Season Pass, which is gonna give you access to two map DLCs, each of them coming with new species, weapons, and weapon skins. Not bad. I mean, if you pay a bit extra for this Elite Edition, you are essentially pre-buying the next two DLCs, with a discount, I guess. So now, regarding the release date, today it was confirmed that the game is gonna come out on approximately seven weeks, on Tuesday, August 16. So that is a bit more than two months. And to be honest, the only thing that worries me is that the game seems to be finished, but we haven't seen gameplay yet. We have seen plenty of pictures, but no gameplay yet. And I think everyone wants to see how the game is gonna work. Because I know a lot of people won't like that the game is already ready to be pre-purchased, and we still haven't seen the actual gameplay. So I think we should see some as soon as possible. Because I understand that perhaps they are trying to polish it as much as they can before showing it, but at this point, seeing that release date, I guess the game is pretty much finished. So for us the consumers, the sooner we see gameplay, the better. Hopefully really soon, because I wanna see the mechanics, the first person animations, and a lot of things. Every hunter knows there's always another chance, because no two hunts are ever the same. 